What's up, YouTube? So, in this video, I'm going to be talking about Sean Wade, um, corner out of uh, Ohio State. Uh, obviously, most of the people that are familiar with the draft know who Sean Wade is. Uh, he was a guy that was kind of being hyped up early on in the process. But as the 2020 season went on, he had a pretty rough season. Um, he really got beat by some pretty good competition. And uh, there are definitely some clear reasons why. But the Baltimore Ravens drafted him in the fifth round. He is 6'1", about 196. So he does have the length um, to be a solid corner in the league. Um, the big issue with for me is that I don't really like him being on the outside uh, very much. I think he really lacks that big-time uh, speed. He doesn't really have that second gear to deal with those fast guys. And he also doesn't have the agility to really handle the quick, twitchy guys either, like the precise route runners and stuff like that. So he is kind of lacking physically. Um, but he does have some okay uh, route recognition and everything like that to be a pretty decent nickel in the league. Uh, the only weird thing is that, you know, w with him and Brandon Stevens, them drafting two nickel corners, which is kind of weird, but whatever. Just talking about the player in general. Um, I think if you keep him inside, I think he can be a decent player for you. Uh, if you have to play him in, on the outside, like if you, you know you just have like a run of injuries or something like that, then probably try to keep him in like cover two, cover three, because um, you don't really want to, or it, or at the very least, just kind of try to manage who he ends up going up against. Like um, he's six one and almost two hundred pounds. So let's just say you were about to play against like last year's Chiefs offense, right? Um, you wouldn't want to put him up against like Tyree Kill because he'll kill him with his speed. If you were going to put him up against somebody, you'd put him up against Sammy Watkins, the slower, more physical guy who's not so twitchy. Um, or if like you were going to do like, like, or like if he was if you were going to play Dallas, you wouldn't want to put him against like Amari Cooper who's going to, you know, just tear him up with his route running. You might want to put him against like a Michael Gallup, you know, that type of thing. Just kind of try to manage his matchups a little bit and do a lot of zone uh in in like Defcon 5 situation where you lose a bunch of corners. But ideally you'd want him in the slot and hopefully he doesn't have to deal with uh too many people by himself who are more athletic than him. So if you do that, he can be an okay player for you who can develop, so I'm not mad at the pick. But anyway, uh, that's going to be it for this video. If you liked it, appreciate hitting that like button. If you have any questions or comments, leave in the comments down below. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.